Do not follow along. Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is gonna be a pretty little things in Blue haul. And as you can see, what you see right here is like the clothes I have on my bed. So it's kind of a lot. So I don't want this video to be too long, so I'm gonna keep this little intro short. But just know that this is a plus size clothing haul from Boohoo and Pretty Little Things. Um, I both I got these items on sale, so um, I'll probably send the sale price rather than the real price, just because that's what I'll see on the um, email that I'm referring to. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will have clips for some of the clothes that I tried on, but the clothes that didn't really fit the way I wanted it to, or I couldn't really style because it's not the right thing or what i expected it won't be shown but i'll of course show the item but on me i'll show the clothes that i actually like and i was able to style okay so i'm just gonna scoot over because i'm gonna have the videos of me here so that's just why i'm like kind of shifted so yeah so first i ordered the most from um Guru, so i'm gonna do pretty little things first so the first thing i ordered were some clear heels so First of all, this box is like really small. I ordered a size 10 wide and the box looks so small. Like, do you see how small this box is? Like, it's very small. The buckle's hanging out because I just tried to close it. But no, this box is really small and I was really confused because on the box it says um, 841.10, but right here it says 10. I don't know if you guys can see, but it says 8 on it. So I was like, oh, is this an eight? But um, Pretty Little Things stuff is measured in, I think, um, in UK sizes. So an eight in UK is a 10 in um, US. So this is 10 wide, it's right. So this small box, when you open it up, these are what they look like. Um, when I tried them on, I didn't really know how to buckle it because if you look at it like, it's just like two strings so you have to just like wrap around your ankle and i styled this with several of the other pieces that i have so i'm gonna show you guys what i paired it with and what they look like um they're you know they're cute but one thing that i kind of don't like is how um how this is kind of slippery so just be careful if you put too much lotion on you don't want to have too much stuff on the bottom of your feet because your feet gonna slide like slide through the bottom easy but the one thing I kind of don't like about these heels, as you can see, is like this is like straight down where in other heels that I have, um, it covers the whole heel. So I have wide feet. This is a wide shoe, so I have wide feet. This extra space from the heel, it kind of allows my foot to turn. It's easier to like fall in these because they don't cover the whole heel. Instead, as you can see, they just cover like the block, which is okay. But just for me, like, I'm used to walking in heels that cover the whole area. Y'all get what I'm saying? I don't want to keep rambling, but I hope what I said makes sense, basically. Like, I just wish, like, it covered the whole heel instead of just the block, you know? But overall, I love these shoes. Okay, the original price was 58 and I got it on sale for 34.80. So, yeah, I got these on sale for 34.80. Just going to move on to the actual clothes now. So... First thing I got is on the tag is the plus light blue renaissance mesh high neck bodysuit. Okay, so I just realized I ordered it in a size 22, but it gave me a 26. So I didn't try, well I tried this on, but I didn't like film this because it was way too big. Like you can even see like how wide the neck is. Like when I put this on, it was like hanging down. So I didn't like it. But I like, like, you know what it looks like. This is the print and my hand, it is kind of see-through. But I like it, it's long sleeve, it's mesh all the way down. The sleeves are really wide on me too, so I didn't really, you know, pair it. And it's a bayou suit, so they have hygienic protection on it, so you don't remove this until after, which is cute. Um, but you know, if it's yours, you know, your bayou suit, you can take it off, but I haven't really worn it out yet. Um, and it has all body suits have like the little buckles to put on there. So I got this on sale. The original price was 30 and I got it on sale for $18. But I don't know. I'm going to try to like see if I can shrink this or something just to make it smaller because it's really big. But this is from pretty little things. So 
yeah so next thing is this dress this is the plus black renaissance print rush one shoulder midi dress so i really like this dress at first i didn't really know how to um style it because when you first get it it's going to be really long as you can see um it comes with strings on the side strings on both sides so when you tighten the strings um it'll rise up and give get, get more ruffled as you can see right now it's ruffled because when i when i tried it on i pulled the strings and i kind of made it shorter because that's i think that's how it's supposed to be worn so when you tight when you pull it the strings like tighten and they can also be loosened when you pull the strings like it just ruffles it up and creates like this ruffled look but I really like this dress. Um, I styled this with the clear heels and an orange purse. The one sleeve is mesh, just like the bodysuit, long sleeve. And this is the first time we're doing a haul, so I'm trying to figure out like how, what I'm, exactly am I supposed to show? Um, so this is the tag. Um, I paid $13 for this. I don't remember the original price, but I got this for $13. So, yeah. Um, the next thing I have is another dress. Um, this is also a mini dress, but I didn't really pull the strings like I wanted to. It's a plus rose floor printed bar dot rush mini dress from Crazy Little Things. And I wore this too, but when I tried it on, I didn't really like tighten them up as much as I did with the Renaissance dress. But this one is off the shoulder. So this is what the top looks like. And like I said, the dresses come really long like do y'all see how long this is like this is really long like i folded it in half and this is how long it is so if you don't pull the strings this is how long it's going to be but like i said with the, with the black renaissance dress it comes with strings and then when you pull the strings it ruffles up and gets shorter so that's what the um that's how it looked on the picture on the website and then when I tried it on, I kind of kept it kind of like a long maxi dress. But I think in the future, just so it could be cute and ruffled, I'm going to pull the strings like this. Next item is the plus size stone woven buckle detail taper pants. This is also from Pretty Little Things. And it looked really cute on the model, but I didn't, um, I didn't record with this just because I wasn't really sure if I liked it or not. So I continue to try to style it and see if I like it. But on the model, it looks good. Um, I guess I shouldn't have sized up. I don't think I said my sizes in the beginning. For Pretty Little Things, this is my first time shopping for Pretty Little Things. So I got everything in a 22. And the shoes were a 10 wide. But everything else I got in a 22. Just because some um, some um, plus size places, they saw it run small. And I didn't really, I didn't really know what Pretty Little Things ran like, so I sized up. But some things fit perfectly, and some things were too big, like the bodysuit. So I was just letting y'all know if I didn't see my sizes. But these pants, I got down to 3X, which is a 22, and they were big on me. But there's nothing that a quick altering can fix. And one thing I like about Pretty Little Things, all their clothes come with like this little ribbon. And on the ribbon it says, please do not remove unless you are satisfied with this garment. Returns will not be accepted if this is removed. So if you don't like it, you know, you keep this on, you can return it, get your money back or get store credit. But I like the the top of it because it has like this ruffled print and I'm a business major. So I thought like, you know, I'm gonna need more dress pants if I'm, you know, going to events and stuff. So I got it because I like the way the top was like ruffled and it's khaki. And I really like the belt. I didn't do the belt right, but y'all get the picture. And the zipper is on the side. The zipper is real thin, but this is the zipper right there. And then it slides on the side. And yeah, um, I didn't really try to use them on because when I tried it on, they were like bell bottoms on me and like I'm tall. So they have a perfect length, especially if I wear heels. But like, I just didn't like how the bottom look because as you can see, they are huge, like, I have thick thighs, but even the bottom is, like, wide, so I'm gonna have to get this altered just so it can fit right, because this is how the leg looks, and I don't like that. So I paid $13 for these pants. These pants were $13. This is the last thing I got for Pretty Little Things, and then I'll tell y'all my total, and, you know, 
how much it was with the sale and taxes and stuff. So this is the plus khaki rib turquoise button detail midi dress. Compare little things. This is cute. It kind of gives me like sweater dress vibes, like cute olive green color. I like it's long sleeve and on the sleeves it has like these buttons on both of them. So I thought that was cute. Um I actually like this and I don't know why I didn't record this when I was putting the styles together. I think because I didn't know what shoes to put with it. But um I got this in the 22, like I said, um, with everything else. And I think I will style this either with my yacht club vans or the clear heels or just maybe some sandals, you know, just whatever the vibes is. But this is definitely something I'll wear in the fall. I don't know about the summer, just because it might be hot. And it's not a thick material, like it's kind of thin, but it's not see-through. But, and this can help you get like a picture, but it's kind of thin material, but it's a little head. And it also has buttons on the side with the little slit. And I really like this little slit that it has on the side with the buttons, I thought that was cute. And, there's no buttons on the other side. The other side is just a basic material, like a skirt type. So yeah, that's this dress. I like it. This was $17, but I like it. So, you know, that's why I got it. So that was everything from the Pretty Little Things. And I'm looking at my computer. That's why, like that. The total was 143 and I did express shipping, which was $9.99. I had the coupon code, so that took off 35, 20, and then 26, 92 is my total. So, yeah, that was kind of expensive, but it was still good for the few items that I got, especially their heels, because heels is supposed to be expensive. So, now moving on to Boohoo. Okay, so first item from Boohoo is I took the tag off this stuff. I, okay, I'm gonna just tell y'all, like, off rip, I like Boohoo better than Pivotal Things. Um, not only because of their sizing, the way it fit, but also the price. And just because I took the tag off when I tried it on. That's how I knew it like this. This is the plus ruffle hem sleeveless shift dress in size 22 in the color black. So this is what it looks like. And I really, really love, not only is it sleeveless, so that I'll probably wear it with a blazer or a sweater if I'm going to like a business event. So it's sleeveless, but the thing I really like about it the most is the ruffle bottom. Like that is so pretty. Like it's so pretty. And the way it fits on me, it fits at the perfect length. So it's not too long. It's like right above the knee. So yeah, this material is very soft, but also kind of, you know, thick. So you're just wondering what the material felt like. But yeah, I really like this dress. And I got it for $12.07. <laughs> Don't judge me, y'all. I know I kind of have a lot of black stuff. Okay, this item is another black dress. I know this one is like an off the shoulder black one. It's the black jumbo rip off the shoulder maxi dress. And I got this in a size 20, and this was also $12.07. So this is what it looks like. I styled this with the clear heels and a little clutch, as you can see. Um, it's really long and I like that because that's how I thought it would be and that's how I looked on the model. It's like mid sleeve. I wouldn't say it's long sleeve, it's like mid sleeve. Um, but the this the the top is wide so you know it stretches a good amount of stretch. The material is like a kind of like that pretty little things turquoise dress material, but this is a little thicker, but it has like the same kind of print and it's stretchy as well. And the bottom is just a basic black bottom, like a pencil skirt type, straight black bottom. So yeah, I really like this. It's comfortable. I wore it around the house, and I'm probably gonna style it like I did the clear heels and just wear it out one day. So this is a <laughs> this is the last black thing I got from here, y'all. But this is just a plus size Bantu fitted midi dress in a size 20. Um, the, I have a tag still on this. Cause I didn't record this in the video. Yeah, just like the other one is stretching on the top and it has like a little space, a little extra material in the front for, you know, be stretchy like I said. And then the bottom is just this basic straight black bottom. But the one thing I like is it has a little slit in the back. See, it has like a little slit in the back. And I thought that was cute. 
and it's a good length so the slit isn't showing too much and i also got this in a size 20. so these are the plus how ways to stretch skinny jeans in a size 20 uk 22 sorry um i didn't even try these on yet just because i'm picking up my jeans so i pick it up and it's not the way out like at the bottom then i probably won't even try it on because i like it said skinny jeans, so I thought it would be skinny jeans, but you know, plus size skinny jeans is kind of iffy because, you know, some people have bigger calves and ankles, and some people have big thighs and skinny ankles, and that's me. So, this is the bottom of the jeans, and this is kind of wide for my legs. Like, usually, the jeans I have from Forever 21, the bottom looks like this, which is perfect because it goes around my ankle and still leaves a little space. So it's not too tight, but sometimes, you know, it's okay if it gets it like this. This is jeggings level, but like, this is kind of too wide for me because it will end up looking like bootcut jeans, and I don't like that. But this is a size 20, like I said. Um, this is what it looks like. But and it has real pockets and real back pockets, and then the knees are distressed. So this is one knee. what the knees look like the some cute ribs which I liked because it looked cute on the model but I don't know I probably try to like roll it up and style it with something but as of right now I'm just gonna leave these alone but I got these for $12.93 hey y'all this I got this this is a good deal I got this for three dollars and forty five cents this is the plus Lissy leopard mini skirt in a size 20 this is the tag. I ripped it off, but I kept it. But I really, like, if you look at this, it looks short. Let me show you. This is the skirt, the whole skirt. I hope y'all can see. This is the whole skirt. Like, literally, it fits in the screen. So, it's a mini skirt, for real. But when I tried it on, and I paired it with the um, another item I got that I'll show, but I really like this skirt. Like, it's basic leopard material. It's a mini skirt. Um... I wouldn't say it's see-through, but it's kind of thin and it has, you know, beige on the inside. And I really like it. Like, it's comfortable, it's stretchy, good. I love it. And I paired it with the Plus Barton Living Body Suit in white. And this is a size 20. Um, it's a tag. And I really, really love this body suit. Like, I just like the top ruffle i just like ruffle tops and bottom stuff like that black dress with the ruffle this has the ruffle top and this long sleeve with the ruffle ends on both sides and it's a bodysuit so it comes like this and then it has the bodysuit clamp at the bottom so i really like this like i really like this okay so next item is this plus off the shoulder midi dress in a beautiful mustard color. It's a size 20 and I just love the, like, the, the way it looks. I like the top front and I love off the shoulder stuff. So y'all didn't know, now y'all know. This is what the sleeves look like. I love bell sleeve stuff with the ruffle bottom because it kind of matches with the sleeves. So I really like that. Like I really like this. It just, yellow, yellow will be popping on melanin. So I really like this. I'm definitely gonna wear this come the summertime and we out of quarantine i'm gonna definitely pop this out because it's cute and i got this for twelve dollars and seven cents just like everything else y'all gotta catch some sales okay i only shop on sale like the first thing i do when i go to the store website is go to the clearance section or go to the you know just the first thing i do is try to go to the sale area because you'll be surprised yes it will be off season stuff in the sale but the whole point of the sale is just getting a stuff for a good price. So even if you get something off season, you can still save for the next season. And you have paid a way lower price than what it was in the original, you know, season. So like you saw, like some of the stuff is long sleeve and I might not be able to wear it in the summer. But the way global warming set up right now, you'll be surprised what you can wear. So, um, yeah, I might be popping that out come the summertime, just depending on the weather. But I just feel like you can never go wrong with a discount or a sale. So I always try to catch a sale. And then usually when I'm shopping, the first thing I do 
is when I get on the, just a, the um, if I get to the new arrivals page or the just in, you know, like the newest clothes page, I try to sort it from price from low to high just because it's like a mindset thing. Like you want to find the cheapest things, so you might as well sort it from lowest to high. So if you see something on sale and it's like new, then it's just like a win-win situation, you know? But anyways, the next item, I didn't try this on just because I didn't know how to tie it, like put it on. And it's a bit oversized, but before it looks like I'm putting on a blanket, um, this is the Plus Extreme Sleeve Wrap Front Tie Top. Yep, this is in size 20. And okay, the way it looks on the, the model is gorgeous. And that's what really attracted me to it. But I just don't know. Like, it looks like a jacket. And then it came with the belt. So it was kind of like, Maya, you have to figure this on your own. But the sleeves. But, okay, I don't want to stretch the sleeves out because it'll look like I'm holding a blanket. But like, sleeves are really wide. But it's just a cute, heavy bell sleeve. But like, you just got to know how to put it on and I don't know that yet so I was gonna watch some other hauls to see if anybody bought this and see how they put it on but it's cute in my opinion um I'm not really doing it any justice by holding it up but it's really cute and I got it for $13.79 so and the last piece of clothing that I got from Boohoo is this plus woven leopard long line kimono in size 20 so oh this is what I was gonna say my size and pretty much is 2020 2022 and then tops is like 2x, 3x, it just depends on the brand. So Forever 21 used to be my go-to. Like this shirt is from Forever 21. Um, that's just my go-to, but now I'm trying to branch out. Cause Forever 21 kind of getting expensive and they sell, don't really be helping. Whereas Boohoo sell, I think was 60% off everything. Pretty Little Things had 40% off. So it's just like, I did that, just that. So, good. so I'm done with the clothes. As you can see, I'm trying to push it back. The last thing I got from Boo Boo was this mini purse. Um, it's really cute. Um, this is a small tote crossbody bag. And it's like, I wear it in the videos. You can see I just wore it as a mini purse. But it does come with the strap. So you can put the strap on the side buckles and wear it as a crossbody. So that's probably what I'll do. But when I styled it, I just wanted to wear it as like a mini purse because it's cute but this was $12.93 from Boohoo and I just thought it was really cute it has plastic on the little gold parts so you can just peel it off whenever you want to I haven't put it off yet because I just realized that was on there but yeah so that's it for this haul you guys hope you guys enjoyed this video um this is something I've never done before so I'm sorry if it's like kind of you know iffy and the camera wasn't right or if I wasn't doing it right I apologize I'm sorry I didn't try on everything but if I didn't like the way it looked, then I wasn't gonna like show myself in it. That just wasn't how I was feeling. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And you know, let me know if you like these kind of things because I online shop pretty often. So if you guys wanna see more of these, just comment down below, let me know. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you guys next time. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know what, you know what I'm saying, what items were your favorite. Um, I'll try to find the links to everything and put it in the description box, but some things while it was on sale is sold out right you know right after the sale so i don't think i can find the links to everything but if i can find the links for most of the items i would try to put them in the description box down below but i'm not gonna keep you guys up for any longer because i know this was kind of long already so i hope you guys enjoyed make sure you like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time bye loves